Hello, everybody. This is Anomalous from Twitch. Vince Dragonborn on YouTube. Also, find my videos on Magic Gathering Strat. Uh, we we are doing a um, Born of the Gods draft today. Uh, just because I want to practice it because I want to keep doing them. And I think I'm pretty bad at them. If you saw my last draft, you'll know why. So this is a tough pick for me because I don't know the format very well. I think Perplexing Chimera is really good. But I don't think it's first. Like, is it better than... It's probably better than Archetype of Imagination. It's probably not better than Retraction Helix, though. And then also there is, like, a Thunder Brute. It's not that great. There's a Servant of Timeret, which is very good. And an or Eskos Sun Guide. And a Snake of the Golden God. Um, I think Retraction Helix is... Or a Servant? And I think I'm just going to take the Servant. Just because to stay out of the... Uh, the problem Blue is going to have. Uh, so let's see. Archetype of Finality? I don't think is that good. It costs 6 mana for a 2-3... It gives all your creatures death touch, though. Uh, might send a bad signal. Uh, there's also another servant here, which I'm just going to right-click on. There's another retraction helix. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. It's either... This is this almost the same print run, actually. It must be with these ones. I don't know. The, the print run's out. I'll have to redo my draft helper thing to figure this stuff out for me. Oh, there's also a sprigleaf drum. I really like Springleaf Drum. Or Springleaf Drum. Do I like it more than a Servant of Timer, though? It's a good question. Probably not. All right. Let's see. So we've already passed. So it looks like we might go be going into Black Blue, because Claim of Erebos is terrible. Drown in Sorrow. Not really that good of a card in this format. Everything usually has more than two toughness. And it affects your creatures too. There's an Oracle's Insight, which works pretty well with the two servants. And there's also a Nyxborn Triton, which is just a, just a solid card. Uh, and a Deepwater Hypnotist. Um, so it's hard to tell if black is being cut, because black is so shallow in this pack. There's really just like a fix, asphyx, asphyx, Asphyxiate and Servant of Timeret. But it seems that blue is going to be open from our right, and maybe green. I'm just gonna. I've never played with Oracle's Insight before. I, I wanna. I wanna play with it. Okay, here's some good signs. Whoa, whoa! Why is there an Everflame Eidolon still there? Uh, we'll just pass that Everflame Eidolon. Uh, between Asph Asphyxiate, Strike Harpy, and another Servant, I have no idea. I think I want. Something besides another servant. I'm, I'm going to take the harpy, but I don't know if that's correct. It might just be asphyxiate. Like, I have no idea. Uh, let's see. Whims of Fate. So I want to play. Ooh, a retraction helix. Not close, I think. Right? Okay, well, there's a necrobite and an exporn eidolon. But there's another retraction helix, so we'll just take that. Um, we have a Marsh Mist Titan, which goes okay with our black cards. Uh, a 1-3 three for 3, no. I think I'm just going to take the Stratus Walk here. I like it. I forgot that it could make... I did not realize it made it so it could only block creatures with flying. Uh, which is a significant downside compared to what I was thinking before. Uh, there's an Astronomer, and then there's a Loyal Pegasus. I think, even though we've seen a lot of good white, we've seen a lot of good everything from the right, but especially blue. So I think I'm going to stick with the blue. Um, there's a Vortex Elemental, which is okay. It is a removal spell. Right? Target creature blocks Vortex. Yeah, there's also an Archetype. I don't know what's better here. Vortex Elemental, each creature blocking or blocked by it. I'm going to guess it's the Vortex Elemental. 
Uh, what? That was like one of the best cards in the pack. Uh, Sanguimancy, I don't think, is a very good card. I'll just take this, just in case black gets cut. Ugh. So here's a question. It's also a late skirmisher. Ah, uh, yeah. Do I think that I want this or this? They both seem... Like, I don't know. I don't know, I'm going to take the archetype. I guess that could be wrong. Swordwise Centaur tabled? I don't know what's going on in this draft. I'll just take this. I have no idea what's going on. I will I will tell you that. Blue should be bad this pack. Blue should be bad this pack. So maybe I should have went green? No. No, I don't think so. So my uh my goal here is to get good black in this pack cuz I think the only thing there's an asphyxiate and an archetype made it past us that was good. Um I'm keeping this Forsaken Drifter too, because it works pretty well with the Stratus Walk. Uh, you can have that card. Um, so good black this pack, and then good black and blue the next pack. But not good blue next pack. Unlikely. Very unlikely. Ooh, Mendomia. Uh, yeah... Just let me double check. I think I don't think it's worth enough to take. Even if it's a mythic. Adomia, no, it's definitely worth enough to take. Uh, what am I passing over it? Since I'm not green, probably. I'm passing an ordeal? Ooh. Really wish I would have taken that, uh... The thing that lets you splash. Let's see, what does Ordeal do? Ordeal. Ordeal's pretty good in my deck, but can I pass up half a ticket? That's a tough one. I don't know. I've got a Vortex Elemental. It seems... I'm just going to take the Ordeal. I think that's wrong. I think you should probably take the uh, thing there. The rare. Just in terms of strict expected value. But in terms of, like, fun and recording. They're not synced? That's weird. How can you tell... Let me check. Uh, anyways, I think we're going to do this disciple here. You tell. Testing. Oh, I guess from the the webcam. Yeah, I don't know what's going on there. Here, I'll get lower. Hmm. Yeah. Sorry. When I in my in my preview, it looks fine. Uh. How can I fix that? Hmm. How many seconds is it? I can set up a delay. It's four seconds. Um, in this pack, I guess it's just a Triton Fortune Hunter. Yeah, it's just a Triton Fortune Hunter. Give me one second. Properties. Use buffering. Milliseconds. I don't know. Testing? Tell me if it got worse or better. I don't know which one I'm supposed to be buffering. 
No, yeah, I checked. It's distinct on my end, too, just not here. Yeah. Uh, so like the, there's like a swan song, which I don't think is worth anything, because it's only played in like... Yeah. Uh, so in this pack, for me, there's a Fate Foretold or a Vaporkin. Um... I'm not really sure. Video comes first. So is it better? Is it any better now? Because I delayed it by two seconds for the video. Um, I'm not sure between Va Vaporkin and Fate Foretold in this deck. I think I'll take the Vaporkin. That could be wrong, though. Ooh, okay. Now that I have two ordeals. Oh, no, wait, right, I have an ordeal. Um, yeah, I'll just take the ordeal here. Not close. Um... I do like Curse of Swine. Curse of Swine is pretty bad, or good against, or like, can I splash the Hoplite? No, not yet. If I would have taken the uh, thing. No difference at all. Hmm. It's weird that it would be the same on my end. Uh, here, I think I take the Curse of Swine. Just because it's sort of removal. Properties, buffer. Audio input device. I don't know, whatever, I'll fix it later. Oh, but maybe we can splash a sentry for the underworld. Uh, just because it's easier, it's much easier to splash a 5-drop than it is to splash a, uh, what other drop was that? Tell me if you opened money. <laughs> Probably not. I opened, I opened half a cent. Um, do I, am I going to play any of these? I guess I'll take the Triton just in case I need to. Uh, I think I'll take the Lampad. Wow, the ordeal tabled. That is... Green is open, sadly. Um, I think for my... Oh, no, I have two ordeals. Might want to play it. Don't want to, but I might want to. One drops go well. I feel like Sea Lock Monster over Curse. Uh, that's fair. I don't have any removal at all besides like a Shrike Harpy so far, though. So, I don't know. This deck doesn't seem very good. Well, it seems okay. Oh, Fate Foretold Tabled, anyways. Cool. I will pass one song. I will hate the Acroan Crusader. Ah, uh, they can have a messenger speed. And, like, I'm not doing Q-Draft because they're negative expected value, because I wouldn't do an 8-4. I wouldn't do a single elimination. And I'm not doing Scars because this is too expensive right now. Because I don't have any packs or anything, so it costs me 14 tickets to do a draft. And then I'd only win packs that could use in Scars. None of these are... Oh, well. That's not worth any money. Um, this pack has a Disciple and a Keepsake Gorgon. You can just slam the Keepsake Gorgon. Not close. Alright, so there is removal in this pack, but there's also a Nimbus Nyad. And Nimbus Nyad is pretty good. Uh, we didn't get the hookup on black we wanted, sadly. Oh, I guess we did pass one Servant to over... The third Servant over, like... A Shrike Harpy or an asphy Asphyxiate. Asphyxiate. I don't actually want to play that. Um. Yeah, Lash of the Whip isn't that great. Don't want to play that, really. I guess maybe the Anvil Rot Raptor. I want to play with the Oracle's Insight. 
don't really want to play with that. Don't really want to play with that. So we need some... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why can't you all be in different packs? This is not fair. Uh, so I just want to take this entire pack and then call it a deck. Yep, that's what I want to do. Since I can't do that, I think it's between Shipwreck Singer and Griptide. And I have no idea, but I think I want Griptide here. Just because I don't have a lot of ways to interact with my opponent. And I don't want my opponent to just goldfish me. Ugh, uh, we could have been green something. I guess we should have been green blue. But I saw so many servants and like, I don't know. I'm just going to hate the leaf crown dryad. Um, I guess I'll take the artist of forms. What? Apparently no one's green. I don't know. Didn't look like anyone was black either. Or blue. Some, or white. Look, or, I guess, red. I don't know. I don't know what was going on in this draft. I don't know what was going on in this draft at all. Should have just forced three color green. Uh, do I have any use? Good use for... The... No, the mnemonic wall? Not really. Sigh. Um. Yeah, I'll just take a null for the sideboard. Aqueous form or stymied hopes? Hmm. I guess with the two ordeals, I sort of want an aqueous form. Sort of. Alright, so, should have been green. Should have been green-blue, I guess? I don't know. Should have just taken the rare. First pick, first pack. That's what I should have done. Should have taken that chimera. Or probably the Retraction Helix. Retraction Helix is probably better. Hello, Colbin 123. Or Col Colin B. Not Cop, Col Col whatever I said. Ugh, look at all. Yeah, I should have just went three color green. I'll hate the rage. Ooh, Lash the Whip table. Nice. Nice. Okay, good. Shipwreck Singer did table. I'll take that over Scourge Mark. I was hoping. I didn't I didn't say anything because I didn't want to get my hopes up, but it happened. Bad the giant. Just in case. Test. Ashfidel Wanderer. So this, wait, milliseconds? Should this be 2,000? Testing. Ooh, Bronze Sable. Is that any better? Because it looks weird on my end now. All right, let's just get that in. Uh, maybe, definitely, no. Maybe. Err. What do you... All right, so this deck is terrible. Yeah, it should have been green. Like, look at the gr Yeah. I don't know. Don't know what to tell you, folks. 
probably, I think I navigated the first pick wrong, and that just sort of spiraled that out of control. I believe. So one of these three cards, really, is coming in. Probably a creature. Yeah, it should have been blue-green, I guess, because I didn't get any black cards in pack one, or pack two, even though I only recall passing two of them. Which is which would be one archetype and one servant. Or, well, and an asphyxiate. It was in the same pack as a servant. Oh, well... Yeah, and I don't have any huge costs besides the Keepsake Gorgon, so I think I can run 17 lands. Think I can run 17 lands. Do I want to run the Artist? I've heard it's not great, but it can't be that bad. Can't be that bad indeed. I don't know, I'm gonna try out the Artisan over the Archetype, just because it's cheaper and it holds an ordeal, even if it can't target anything. And uh, I wanna go back in time and take all the green in pack two, I guess. Because I could have had some other stuff. Looks like I could have had a good green blue deck. <laughs> I have a beard. I have a beard until it gets so hot that a beard will be uncomfortable, and then I will have no beard. All right, so this is this terrible deck. This terrible deck that should have been green. Ah, uh, join me for the rounds. Also, people in the chat tell me if this, the voice... If my lips are syncing up better with the voice. Or whatever. I will submit, and I will check. Uh, join me for the rounds, people. Uh, whatever. Whatever.